Well, call it a prescription for compromise at the state capitol. Pharmacists are now allowed to administer some vaccines to younger children. They'd like to do this even more, but pediatricians and family doctors don't like the sound of that. Dennis Owens reports. And just like that, you're all dead. Young kids getting COVID vaccines and flu shots in the neighborhood pharmacy. I really think it is a big step forward, and it gets us least uh, Pennsylvania in getting in line with some of the other states out there. It's now reality since House Bill 2679 became law, reducing the age pharmacists can give those two shots from nine to five. We're actually hearing from a number of our pharmacies how grateful parents are. I couldn't get in, you have it. They were lined up at some of these pharmacies the first day the bill passed. Supporters insist it's about greater convenience for parents who otherwise might not get their kids inoculated. The most important outcome for us was access. And so, you know, thinking about pharmacies being open, a lot of them 24 seven, it's around, it's seven day a week access. They're not delivering shots at 3 a.m. <laughs> no, no. And we're not giving them at 3 a.m. either, but we are available to uh, respond to parents' concerns at 3 a.m. Dr. Marianne Regis, president of PA's chapter of the American Academy of Pediatrics, says flu shots and COVID vaccines are fine for pharmacists to give to five and up, but it should stop there. I'd honestly think that it's a, a push from a business perspective, but not necessarily from a best care perspective. Trying to take that three-year-old to a busy retail pharmacy and trying to stand in line. Dr. Jason Woloski is the president of the PA Academy of Family Physicians. He worries trips to the pharmacy will replace trips to the doctor's office and the various screening that docs do. Our big concern is that if we allow pharmacists to do all of the childhood immunizations, we're going to lose that incentive for parents and guardians to bring the kids into the clinic. But pharmacists would like to expand that law to include all immunizations for kids as young as three and say any fears are unfounded. Pharmacists are trained to have the ability to do it and a lot of states have the authority to do it. Kind of hard to argue access. 90% of Americans live within five miles of a pharmacy. In Camp Hill, Dennis Owens, ABC 27 News.